This video will walk you through the steps of copying HL7 components, something that can save you time when building a production. Rather than creating a new HL7 component from scratch in the production, we can create a new component by copying an existing one. Suppose we want to copy the HL7 file operation. To do that, first click the HL7 file operation. In the Action tab, click Copy. Next, specify the name of the new component, for example, 2ABC lab file, and click OK. As you can see, 2ABC lab file now appears under the list of business operations. By default, the new component will have the same settings as HL7 file operation, so we might need to update the settings of the new component to make sure it works as we want it to. For file business services, it is common that you will need to update the fields file path and file name to specify the file name and source of the input data. After you have finished updating the settings, click apply to save those changes. If you want to copy the 2ABC lab TCP operation, apply the same process as above, but change the IP address and port fields to the corresponding values of their receiving application. Now you have learned how to copy an existing component. This approach is a fast and efficient way to create a new component that is similar to an existing one.